So you see, the thing is, I've not really been using my pistol all that much. So I don't want to spend any points on that. I've got four weapon points to spend, and I don't want to upgrade anything, and I do not understand how this works. If anybody can explain that to me, uh, I'll be very grateful. It says get 20 direct hits on imps. <laughs> what with? Explosive shots? I'm pretty sure I've got at least one whilst trying to figure that out. Anyway, welcome back to Doom. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'll see you next time. No. Uh, welcome back to Doom. I hope uh, you have enjoyed the series so far. I've just come back out of this... Um, challenge that we did which was right here the rune is actually wrecked so we can't even try again um i mean i'm just gonna keep playing i don't know what to do with those weapon points that's the annoying thing i mean i've got i've also you know absorbed i can upgrade this apparently um and i've got the other one which i didn't even understand unlocked by completing four rune trials so I'm going to have three slots and seven runes, so do I need this? Maybe. I mean, I am dropping a lot of items, so being able to pick those up is pretty cool. Uh, can you... Yeah, those are into... Like, that one seems a lot more a lot more better, if that makes sense. I'm going to keep going with this one, simply because we're this far away from the next level of it. And then I can think about the other one, because if, if that stagger means that they... Um, are in the, the the glory killable state for longer. That means I can set up a glory kill on a Hell Knight more easily and any other glory kill challenges that come along. So we've got this remote destination thing here. There's a tutorial that we can... There you go. Um, but I think we're just going to continue. Let's see if there's anything we've missed. There is a objective over there that I somehow walked right past. That's okay. Wasn't really paying attention on the way in. I was... Faffing around. Oh, I didn't walk right past it. I was shooting things in here and didn't actually notice that this was a thing I have to explode. You must stop. The hell energy is unusable without the filters. Apparently, good. Ah, uh, not sure this man that I am playing cares about what Samuel Hayden cares about. So. That's fine. I expect that's going to... Oh. Can we go down there? don't know if I was supposed to do that or what, but I did do that. So that's cool. You die. Won't be long before it was absorbed 300 items. I assume it will flash up and tell me that I've done that. Uh, oh. I was kind of hoping that I had to follow it in order to achieve something amazing, but it turns out that it was just always going to be open. We can't get through. Ooh. Yeah! This amazing man who I am. Who's 100% demon. It's not so impressive if you think that this person is half demon. And honestly, I've not necessarily read anything in the uh, lore to suggest that that's true. But at the same time, I've not really been reading. What's that? There's a bunch of stuff to find. I guess we're going down that way. So we'll have a look. Like your mama. Did we... I remember seeing a shield. I'm not sure if that was a lot longer ago than I'm giving credit for right now. Here's the thing. UAC put... Excuse me? You done? Why are you breathing? Don't like that. What did you just open? UAC personnel. Vega. Running the Arsenal facilities. Like, let's let you know. Computational progress. Brain child of Samuel Hayden. They made it Vega after the... Um, the graphics card. We've been here, right? Stop with the pausing of the sound. I don't want you to pause the sound all the time. I want to continue with the sound. Keep playing the sound. We don't need that. Just pretty nice for once. Uh, no armor, but again, armor is just. Yeah, is Vegas giving up? He's <laughs> not even telling us not to do that. Like plasma stuff. We spent decades perfecting the science, selling it to humanity. We balanced their hell energy with our science, making it usable and safe. We solved an energy crisis the world had no answer for. It works. You cannot do this. God, I mean, you're not selling me on it. That was weird. 
if I'm being honest. I kind of think I've already done it. If it was that important. Oh, hello. Guess I want to kill that. How are we going to get up there? There's another chibi. Oh. Let's go down there and see what that is. It is going to be through here somehow. Some weird ass thing in the corner over there. Goodness knows what it is. We've been in here. Not sure, mate. Not sure. Ooh, who's beeping? You beeping? Hello. Ah, I recognise this. I didn't know what this was. Yes, please. This is the thing that implies that you are capable of... Because you're capable of absorbing all this Argent energy, it implies that you are made of Argent enemy... Argent energy juice. Um, I think we upgrade... We never fill up our armour. I don't really care for it. We upgrade health again. We did actually fill up our health relatively to that, which is nice. Are you beeping at me? Are you beeping at me? Are you beeping at me? I guess you must be beeping at me. I don't see anybody out. It's terrible. Just, oh, I know where we are. Yeah. Uh, it's just a terrible impression. If you can call it an impression. It's horrible. Stop trying. Stop trying to entertain people and just be yourself. You will be entertaining if you are entertaining. If you're not entertaining, get off the telly. Get off the wireless. I hope you've all got your uh, internet licenses. The BBC internet license. The Tories have introduced because everybody has to pay for everything all the time. I'm being facetious. There is not an internet license you don't have to pay to use. I mean, you have to pay to use the internet. But you don't have to pay again to use the internet. Um, I want this to be something. Computer. Please. It's acting like computers used to act like I used to get so frustrated with Unreal Tournament originally because the computer was capable of running it perfectly well but it would be constantly loading all the fucking time and it was so stressful you would not believe how stressful well, you might do you know it was, uh... um, have we been over there? You know, it was, it was, it was, every single thing that I did involved loading. You know, you could turn around and the computer would crunch. I, as far as I could understand, at least now that I'm looking back on it with, you know, the, the knowledge of, of me now, the way computers work, I think it put everything into swap. The entire game was in swap, which meant we had no memory. We had no, um physical memory available to play the game with. So everything was in swap. Ah! Yes, it's me. I wonder if we've picked up 100 things yet. Or 200 things yet. So, it was basically doing this juddering thing. Everything was this juddering thing. There was nothing else in the world, except for this bloody juddering. So frustrating. Very stressful. And my parents would tell me off for getting upset. Like, I think the thing is they thought it was the game itself that was making me upset. Because I used to get really frustrated at Privateer. And Privateer 2. And that was... I would get upset at Privateer and Privateer 2 because it was hard. For sure. So, uh, well, thank you. Appreciate that, Council. Um, but the sounds that it made, the sound of the mass driver was such a thump, thump, thump noise that it was... I didn't realise at the time that I had uh, what I now know to be um, misophonia, i.e. the sound of it was so upsetting to me. Because it was part of the game, I didn't realise that the sound was upsetting me. I just sort of assumed that I was getting stressed for some reason. I want to find that little chippy. How do we find this? It's got to be in there somewhere. How are we going to... There must be a secret door that we have to open. I mean, it's possible that you open it at the end of the game. Where, Where is it? Is it here? 
Not the end of the game, but the end of the level. Actually, here. Yeah. I don't know. Um, and I, yeah, I would genuinely get frustrated at that game because the noise it was making and the difficulty of uh, Space Sim in, in the 90s was... It, it definitely combined to be a non conducive to me not being stressed situation. But, the Unreal Tournament thing, I was actually pretty good at it, you know? I mean, I was only playing the single player against bots, but at the same time... Did that do it? Yes! Happy with that. Pretty happy with that. Just kill him. Don't... Don't try and glory kill him for no fucking reason. Let's um let's get this out. That was good timing. Just when I needed you. Oh come on computer. I apologize for this by the way. Um I think I might have to restart my computer at some point. That's entertaining. There you go. Basically every kill is a glory kill. <laughs> yeah, nice try. Sucker. Where you at? I just pulled the heart out of an imp. So they have hearts too? There must be people. My berserk is lasting longer than it needs to. That's a... That's a obnoxious noise, don't do that. So, that period of apology that I just had to do there is basically how it was working. How, how in real time it was working. Oh, Christ. Uh, all, all the time. Or not working, I guess. So that's probably the X. So there's a couple of things we haven't found. It's not the exit because it's um. Uh, yeah, there's a thing behind it. I still stand by my idea that 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 um cordoned off area was the exit. It's very very computationally intense. I'll tell you one thing. I went to CERN a while ago. Not not all of it. <laughs> there's a lot of it. Um, I went to see. If stopping the... our energy production is what you want, then you need only to destroy this last filter, and Argent Energy will no longer exist in this solar system. We will be back at square one. Go on. Was that the filter? Uh, is it destroyed? I mean, no idea what you have just done. it's. You can make a new one. Olivia is still alive. You have the plans, the right? Signature at the Argent Power. She has removed one of the accumulators from the power base. It has a unique energy signature that we can track. Point is, they actually had what? screens like this at the That's CMS. Done. There's nothing else to be done. Which was a better CMS than ours. So this is the exit. Okay, fine. Um. Hmm. Like I would. Uh, excuse me. I would like to. Remember the twelve counts. Find the stuff. Basically, I know that there is. Why? Why are you always in a weird place? I know the. I know the way out. That's okay. Don't need to. Don't need to worry too much about that. Where is this? Is it actually through this wall, or is it above the other place? If it takes us too long to find it, I might put a cut. I'm still going to keep talking. Also, the fact that it's overlaying the... Um, the health with the new health is a little bit odd. Up there? I mean, I'm up here. Huh. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We found it, we've done it. What a legend. I'm the best. Do -do -eh -eh -eh. That is the best track. Honestly. Thank you for the ammo. I'm ducking by accident. Uh, actual tab, please. Like, just... How do I use the little extras? Huh? 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 Ah, this is 
upgraded. So we're actually going to replace it with that one. This, ah, 25 death from above glory kill. So upgrading this one um, is now going to be slightly easier. So I'm assuming that it is related to glory kills, which is why it's telling me about it. Now then, this. I'm interested. I don't see actually anything on the other side of it. Uh, let's go. This seems fine. Ooh. There's one more thing to find, and I'm a completionist. I'm a recidivist. Another thing I learned from MC Front a lot. In here? I think we've done it. Yeah. Didn't find. Didn't take too long to find, so I'm okay with the amount of time it took me. Uh, that's another Praetor upgrade token. I would like to fill in my HP, but I guess we can do that in future. Um, we're going to go. How do we get out? <laughs> Please. Okay, computer. Teleport me to the exit. I am going to go somewhere. I, I'm lost. I don't remember the way. Honestly, I thought I could just climb up one of these. Can I get up there? I think I might be able to. Hoi! He's done it. And I jump, and you can manage it. Oh, good chap. Well done. Baller. All right, let's get out of here. Let's blow this popsicle stand. <gasps> I assume the idea there is that if you blow hard enough, it's like a very well lunged wolf, you may blow the popsicle stand down. Replace it with your own popsicle stand, thus being a cruel but poignant comment on the nature of capitalism. I guess. Questioning your faith? We guess. Let's go to, um... That's the in <laughs> question. Apparently everyone's being indoctrinated into the same faith. Presumably because they've now found hell, so it's pretty obvious which is the correct... Um, which, which is the correct faith. It's the one that mentioned hell. We have... Two secrets left to find, so there was actually another weapon upgrade point available for us. Ah, I mean, I might go back. The point of this game is to replay the levels and to find the secrets, but I want to record it. <laughs> I don't want to play it without recording it. So, I kind of forget. Oh, excuse me, I'm all hiccupy. I kind of forget that that's a thing, so I sort of don't. Oh, in your own time. Yeah, I lost, uh, I lost half of my gigabytes of RAMs a while ago. It's been quite a long time, so it's not like I lost it whilst this series has been going on. Uh, and yet, here we are, having trouble with memory, so maybe I should restart my computer once in a while. No, I don't really want to. The explosion, you say? You mean the one I made? At least Vega doesn't actually care. It's just telling me stuff and informing me. So now that we have the stun thingy and a buff to stun, kill Olivia Pierce. That seems like endgame shit. Obtain thrust boots. <laughs> My favourite. Um, now that we have a buff to our stun, and we also have a stun. That sounds like a decent synergy. Um, little help. <laughs> Good start. No idea what the fuck I'm doing. Apparently I can go down. Like, as we've mentioned, your mama. How did I not see this? Demons? Give me something to kill. Demon What's happening? Revenant. That's what we like to see. So you can play at that game, mister. I can detonate them any time I like. Nice. I do appreciate that Q does switch between them. Um, kill it. Weapons, so I don't have to figure out how to switch to the... Um... Again, I don't apologise for this. I will restart my computer after this episode. I promise. But uh, this is making me sad. I'm just going to um, press escape for a second. I don't know what it's doing, quite honestly. So I have no excuse for it to be making this much of a mess. I remember um, early on we were saying that perhaps we use the pistol a lot more it, throughout the game, much like you would in 
Unreal, because in Unreal there was a similar upgrade sort of chain to the uh, to the pistol. But I'm really not using it. We're getting more and more weapons with much better capabilities. Okay. That was easy. Yeah, I mean, we're coming to the end of this episode, and I'm just going to look for a suitable juncture, really, and that could really be it. Um, Completed in 2127, based off a prototype developed by Samuel Hayden's I'm research listening. team, the Argent Tower, also known as the Argent Inductor, is the UAC's crowning achievement. I think having achieved a fight against two revenants, and all I had to do was... Damn it, a bunch of rockets in the air, which was great fun. Unfortunately, I didn't get to uh, stab it. Let's find out what this is going to be, and then we will end the episode, and I will restart my computer so that it doesn't happen again. Uh, perform four neck or jawbreaker glory kills on the imp attack behind the uh, the sexy one when you gnaw on its neck. Uh, searching high and low, find three secrets. Kill 15 dem demons using quad damage, so it's, I'm very happy to hear that quad damage is a thing. That's probably it. Oh, no, we did find... Um... All right. All right, just for you. I'm going to go back. Can we get up here? Not quite. I'm going to try and go back if I can figure out how. Computer, please. I'm going to try and go back and we will fight the good fight. By which I mean the um, the rune. I don't know how to get back up there though. So maybe we won't. I'd like to, but I don't think we can. Maybe. Oh, here's a good idea. I'll cut the episode and we can... Okay, go. Uh, have a little mini episode where I just do that rune. Anyway, I'm going to try and figure that out. I will thank you for watching this episode and I hope that you've enjoyed it. Because I'm thoroughly enjoying playing it and making these episodes for all of y'all. Which I believe is an American thing, which means all of you. Uh, everybody. So, until the very next episode when I will have restarted my computer and stopped getting these silly, uh, probably memory-based issues, uh, I'm going to see you around and look forward to maybe us having a... Oh, I see. Uh, hold that thought. This may invoke an attack. This doesn't invoke an attack. For space twice, to go double jump. No attack. Okay. I may make a mini episode, in fact, I'm probably going to do it now. There will be a mini episode in which I do the rune. And I hope that you've enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one. I'm going to finally end it. Goodbye. Thank you. Bye.